N-B-S-W-W-I-T. <laughs> Keep watching to find out what in the world I'm talking about. So hey y'all, it's Kyla Denanyo and welcome to Kyla's Reading Day. So I have been going through this kind of funk, this weird little thing where I didn't know if I had imposter syndrome. Also, I'm just so busy, which means I'm so tired, but am I depressed? And so for the month of March, I am putting out an extra video every Wednesday, which I'm calling the Confidence Series, right? So in addition to reading advertising and marketing books, I am also diving into books about confidence, beating imposter syndrome, what is imposter syndrome, all of it, okay? Today's book is Radical Confidence, all right? The author of this book is Lisa Bilyeu. The genre of the book is nonfiction. The theme of the book is self-improvement motivational. Okay, so look at this cover, all right? Lisa Bilyeu is awesome. And you know how I know that? Because this cover stopped me. I'm walking, I'm walking. Whoa, 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 whoa. Give it to me. <laughs> Let me pick this up. So I'm reading the book and you don't get too far in before she has a really deep conversation with her husband. He's working, she's staying at home taking care of everything. And he's like, give me two years to get running, two years to get running, two years to get running. Well, they do that for about eight years and then they're like, okay, what are we really gonna do? And they come up with this phrase as a part of Bill You Enterprises, right? That's what they were calling their marriage. The two of them were like, we're going. And the thing is, NBS, WWIT. No bullshit. what will it take? Okay, and again, you're not really far in the book when you get that, but I was reading and I just, What excuse could you ever have after reading that, right? And it, it hit me and I was like, I really wanna keep the podcast going. What will it take? I wanna have three sponsors next season. What will it take? No BS, what will it take? So while that was the thing that I enjoyed the most about the book, the reason why I enjoyed it so much, for one, it cut through any and every possible excuse I could ever have, okay? What will it take? Uh, I wanna look better in a bikini, but I don't feel like doing anything. What will it take? <laughs> are you gonna reduce your calories? Or are you gonna move your body more, right? At Lisa goes on to say, she and her husband will set a goal and then they come back to each other and they say, we said we were gonna do this for a year and a half. It's been a year and a half. Are we still on track to do it or do we need to revise? And that's the part I really enjoy because if there's gonna be no bull, you have to make sure you're holding yourself accountable for what you said you were gonna do. I wanna do an extra book review every Wednesday. What will it take? I need to start reading books in February, possibly even the end of January so that I can hit that mark, okay? What will it take without the BS? Not just daydreaming here, just grabbing stuff out of the sky. What will it take? But yeah, so would I reread the book? Radical Confidence. Yes, I was sad to put it down. Fantastic. I mean, I was missing it when it was over. And in fact, I'm now listening to all the Women of Impact podcast episodes because I think Lisa is phenomenal and I wanna know everything and anything else that she's ever doing, <laughs> okay? So thank you so much for watching this video hanging out with me this far. Okay, if you enjoyed the video, please like it. That really does help YouTube share these videos with more people. And I will see you next time. <laughs> Bye.